everyone, welcome to a new episode with Conflicts. Today we'll be reviewing a new robotic kit from Makeblot called MBOT. So let's go ahead and take a closer look. Alright, so this here is our MBOT Educational Robotic Kit. Literally, it teaches you how to build a robot from the ground up, as well as teaches you a little bit about coding. So let's go ahead and take a look at the back. Now on the back here, it shows on the different add-on packs that they sell. Literally, you can change it from different forms, and over here it shows you a little specifications exactly on how the diagram is set up, talking about all the different parts and how they come together. Now on this side here, it talks about the specific specifications, including the inputs and outputs, which is a light sensor, infrared receiver, ultrasonic sensor, as well as a line follower. In addition, it has a buzzer, a red, green, blue LED, infrared transmitter, and two motor parts. Now note, this is the blue version as well as the Bluetooth version. This does come in pink and also comes in a 2.4 gigahertz version as well. So let's go ahead and open this up a little bit more and take a look on the inside. Oh wow, look at that. That's actually a very, very nice setup. Uh, we actually have a nice diagram here showing all the components coming together. And then on the top here, we actually have the two of the biggest components. So we have the aluminum chassis as well as the casing. Now note, this here is actually a very nice metallic finish. I don't know if you guys can tell, but it's got a very nice shine to it. Do note that it does come in pink as well. So let's go and put that to the side for now. Uh, so on the top here, it looks like we actually have... Ah, this here is actually the uh, track. So this is a track that the robot follows with the uh, line tracking the device that it has in it. So we'll go ahead and use that later. Uh, then here we have, a, it looks like an instruction manual kind of explaining detailed steps on how to set this up. And it doesn't look that complicated, so pretty skinny. So it should be fun. And then, oh wow, that's actually a lot of different components in here. So let's go and take a look at this. Now oh, right away I do see that there's a remote. So this should be a lot of cool fun. So uh, we have some nuts and screws, we have some chips, we have casings, we have a screwdriver, a tire, wheels, and so many more parts in here. So this should be a lot of fun. Uh, in which, wish me luck guys and cue that montage. Alright, so our MBOT is finally ready. It took about 15 to 20 minutes to make, but overall the quality is amazing. Literally, this thing looks so cool. So anyways, let's go ahead and give it a test run. Now, there's two apps that we can use. The first one we'll be looking at is called MakeBlock. MakeBlock is a tutorial app that allows you to learn as you go. So let's go and turn on our block, and then we'll go ahead and put our phone over it, connecting to it. Once it's connected, it kind of goes in stages. So the first one stage is control, and then it goes on to wait, and then LED, and repeat. Now literally it's teaching you all about the robot, step by step. So let's just go ahead and do a tutorial on the control. So I already started this, but I'm gonna go ahead and continue it. So I'm on stage five. So it says, now MBOT you has to learn some basic moves. So let's teach MBOT some advanced moves. So complete the following steps. So it's gonna tell us, first tell the bot to move forward, left, backward, then turn right. So all I'm going to be doing is dragging this here and just kind of dropping it in place. So that's move forward, turn left, run backward, and then, whoops, sorry, it has to be connected, there we go, and then turn right. And then if I hit play, move forward, turn left, move backward, turn right. So literally he follows exactly what we scripted. And then I can go ahead and hit continue and move on to the next level. So literally, it teaches you step by step what you can do and helps you learn more about the robot itself as well as functionalities. All right, now for the next one here, we wanna go ahead and have MBOT move in a V-shaped path. Now this requires thinking because they're not telling you what to do. So we have three different keys that we can use. So let's go ahead and start with move forward. Uh, then we would wanna turn left, which makes sense. And then we would wanna run forward for another one second. So let's go ahead and try this out. So that was an actual V, and then it says win, and then I can go ahead and continue. So it's like a little game, and theoretically, you're actually teaching the person how to code at the same time. All right, and then the next app we'll look at is called MakeBlock, made by the same people, but it allows you to control the robot at a full extent. So let's go ahead and open that up, and then we'll go ahead and connect to our robot by simply putting it over the robot, and then we'll go ahead and click on MBOT, and now see we have a joystick, and then we can go ahead and control the robot as we please. 
<laughs> so cool. So that's just the joystick itself. In addition, there's actually a buzzer form, which if you press a button, it's like a horn. <laughs> and then there's other things that you can do too. So you can see the brightness, you can see the ultrasonic, and then you can actually create your own. So let's, for instance, well, if we scroll down here and click plus, we can actually create our own. So let's just say if I wanted an arrow to control his uh, movement, and then if I go into display, I can go ahead and go into LED control. And then uh, there's so many different things here. So let's go ahead and just try that out. So he does have an LED on top. And if I just go ahead and scroll through it, it will change the color of the LED on top, which is really neat. And so in addition to that, there's other different functionalities that they already previously created. One is a music spirit, which allows you to play him as an instrument. So it allows you to go ahead and control him as an instrument. In addition, it shows you how that All right, well that pretty much summarizes the MBOT. Not only is it a great introduction to robot, but it really does teach you about the fundamentals of robotics. It teaches you how to build one, as well as explains everything step by step. In addition, it teaches you how to program, which is really, really cool. I love the apps itself and how it, each of the apps actually kind of explained everything in detail. It was really, really user friendly. Now, with that being said, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you had any questions about the MBOT, be sure to comment down below. Otherwise, thank you for watching and we'll see you in the next episode. Bye-bye.